Hey everybody, in this video, well this is going to be part one of two, I'm going to show you how to take your website and how to put it live on the web. It's actually pretty easy. There's three things you got to do. Number one, you got to get a domain name. Now just in case you don't remember, a domain name is a unique address on the web. So for example, studioweb.com is a domain name, google.com is a domain name, youtube.com is a domain name. Also remember that domain name extensions.com, .org, .net, .tv, and there's hundreds and hundreds of other options. Remember that these are different addresses. So what do I mean by that? For example, google.com is a different address from google.org. Keep that in mind, and when we actually go to register a domain name, well, I'll show you how to do it, we'll look at more details about that. Second step is you got to find a hosting company. Now, a hosting company is just a company that has a server that's connected to the web 24-7, and they have a web server. Remember, a web server is just server software. It's just an app that sits on servers, that's installed on servers, and it uh, the web server apps will serve up web pages just like a waiter serves you food. So what you got to do is you got to rent some hosting space, some web server space. It's called hosting, pay for hosting. It's very inexpensive for most, uh, for most websites. And once you get your hosting, your hosting company will help you configure all of this. It's really simple. It's really simple for you. They take care of it very quickly. And they'll send you a username and password. And then you just have to upload your website, your HTML files, your CSS files, your JavaScript files, your images, your videos, your sound files, whatever is on your website. Has to, then, has to then be uploaded to the web server. And that's it. Then you'll be live on the web. So we'll go through this step by step. It's actually pretty easy. And um, that's pretty much it. So uh, let's get to work. This is my nerd hat. This is what I put on when I start coding. All right. Let's get to it. All right, so uh, let's take a look at the site we're going to upload. This is it here. It's just a one-page site with uh, a photo that we've seen before. Here is the site files. I have uh, an image and an index.html file. If you remember, every website needs an index.html file. This is the first web page of any website, so we have to have that index.html file. Normally, if I had many images, I would have an images folder, and most websites have many pages, etc., etc. But because I'm just demoing, I'm just keeping it simple. So what we need to do is we first need to register a domain name. So the way you do that is you go to a company that allows you to register domain names. And a company that does this is called a registrar. Registrar. So this is one of my sites. I've been running this for a long time now. And one of the things we do do is sell domain names. Now, I'm just going here because it's, it's my site. You can go to any registrar you want. There are many out there. And so let's... Click on this link here, domain names, only $9.99 per year. So we click on that. So that's going to take us to the uh, part of the site that allows us to uh, buy domain names and even buy hosting. You see a lot of registrars, by the way, will have the ability for you to buy domain names from them as well. 